Keegan, how did you get back involved doing stuff with Penn State football? Can you take us through that a little bit? And what has it meant to you? Obviously, you're having a lot of fun doing it, but I see you out there singing your alma mater, and it looked like it was something special to you. Yeah, it, I think um, uh, part of my my journey is, that's interesting is that my parents' best friends were Pennsylvanians. And so as a small child, I watched Penn State football. And so when I had an opportunity to come here to do my graduate studies, it, it ended up being one of the top choices for me for almost nostalgic reasons. The, the good thing is I'm glad, it, I glad, I'm glad it all played out that way because I ended up going to a high level university for what I was studying. And, uh, and I, I taught acting for non-majors here. I was in the Theater 100 company, and so I had constant and personal contact with the football team. I already had a sense of liking football and liking Penn State football, but then to have these players, have a personal relationship with some of the players, meant quite a lot to me and, and resonated with me. And so that's, it's been a big part of my life. And when James came in, <clears throat> um, he's really infused this new energy and you know we have started a friendship, and, a, and and I think we're of like minds in regard to what a student athlete is. I get very very excited when I see him. Um, uh, I get excited when I see him get excited about how well his students do, and I get very excited when his players have uh, you know um, they get some of them get privileges. They get a small privilege here or there if they have better GPAs. It's 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 lovely that academics are as important to him, and so that's part of where the love comes from, and. Um, and then you know, just coming for when I was here to do the uh, to be the, the grand marshal for homecoming, it was really interesting that I, I had noticed it. Somebody had said, "You look a little bit like the new head coach," and the rest is history. <laughs> so it's it's and um, I'll take it if, if if the fact that our genes are similar in some way, shape, or form uh, is one more thing that brings me back to the program and, and having a, a sheer sheer love for the program than so be it. The, the, the only thing I'll add is. Keegan's fiance came up to me and she goes, Coach, do you think we should pad Keegan a little bit across the midsection? I didn't necessarily love hearing that. Um, and then Keegan, before the game, took a family picture. It's gonna be our Christmas card this year. So it was Keegan in with my family. And I have not seen my wife that happy in a long time. I mean, her face just lit up. and. I wasn't completely comfortable with that. Um, so, you know, it is what it is. Obviously, I need to get on the treadmill.